Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is part three to the series on my channel where I taste vegan ice creams and I try to find the best one. If you haven't seen these videos before, basically what I do is I taste test vegan ice creams from all the brands I can find and I find the best one. So today is our part three where I try the rest of the vegan ice creams I found, but I also try all of the winners back to back and see which one takes the cake. So let's just get into it. We only have four ice creams that I will be trying and then the rest of the video will be the competition. So first off we have Kato. I could not find this anywhere and then I finally found it at Natural Grocers because I know that they have the chocolate and the mint one at Walmart and like I've seen those ones everywhere but the vanilla bean I couldn't find anywhere but I finally found it so I'm really glad that I did. And it's made with water, cassava root syrup, and avocado oil. And then obviously the other things. But like, that's really cool. So I'm hoping that it tastes okay. Just looks like vanilla bean ice cream. Wow. Oh, that's good. It's soft. It has a really good vanilla bean flavor. I will say there's a little bit of an aftertaste that almost tastes like cardboard. Other than that, it's really good. I probably give this one a 9 out of 10. Okay, next up is Nada Moo. I have had, I think, two other ice creams from this brand before. Very, very good. I really like the ice creams from... Ooh, a lot softer than the other one. They use coconut milk. So it's good, but there's just something in there that's throwing me off. I don't know what it is. Solid texture, really good sweetness. There's just something in there that's like, I don't know. I'm probably going to give it an 8 or an 8.5. Okay, next up, I've actually had this ice cream before, and I've mentioned in the past that it's one of my favorites, but I haven't had it in a while. So we're going to see how it compares to all the other ice creams. It's good. It's not like wowing me. Mmm. The aftertaste was really good. I will say the texture is a little bit icy. I'm gonna give this one 9 or 9.5. And then last we have Sprouts. I didn't know that Sprouts had their own brand and then I actually got a request to try their ice cream. So I thought it was perfect. Also they didn't have a smaller size. That's why I have this really big one. How fun is that? Okay. And they use coconut milk, obviously. I love the texture. Wow. It's definitely coconutty, but that's really good. I'm surprised. But yeah, it definitely has a coconutty flavor. Mmm, but it's sweet and soft. Wow. I'm mean, gonna have to say 9 or 9.5. Okay, so we're gonna keep this one up here because these were all pretty much the same. And then the winners for my past videos we had Wild Good, Forager, and So Delicious Wonder Milk. I'm gonna go ahead and try these ones again. And no, these are not the same ones from my previous videos. Those didn't last long. They were delicious. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. Uh. 
Oh my gosh, I forgot how good these ones are. Those are so good. Okay, so I'm not talking a lot. I just need to be in a, a mindset, okay? I need to focus. You guys, this is very difficult. Yeah, that one's good, but it doesn't beat the others, so we can omit this one. This one's very good. It has a coconutty flavor, which I don't mind, but we're looking for a solid vanilla bean flavor. Well, I guess best flavor and best texture. Okay, let's try this one again. So far, the, this one has the worst texture. I just think it might need to thaw a little bit more. I don't get a very strong vanilla bean flavor right off the bat. It kind of takes a little bit, so. Let's take that into consideration. It's still really good though, because the aftertaste is delicious. That flavor is better. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I like it better than Brave Robot. And that one used to be my favorite, so that one's very good. Texture, spot on. Flavor, spot on. The texture's not as good, but it's sweeter, and it's really good. That is so hard. They're on the same level. This one has a better texture and the perfect vanilla bean flavor, but this one is just a little bit sweeter, and it's really, really good. We're going to move along <laughs> to this guy. That one's really, really good too, but I think these two flavors are just a little bit better. The battle has begun. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I've made my final decision. Based on everything I've said, can you guys guess which one is the winner? Comment down below before I tell you guys and tell me that you commented before I told you. Okay, the winner is, drum roll please, Wild Good! <laughs> Woo! So they are incredibly close, but Wild Good just has the better texture and the better spot on flavor. I think that this is just a solid vanilla bean. So delicious. Not the brand. This one's so good. But you guys, any of these ice creams I tried today are solid ice creams and if you can find them, I'd highly recommend because they're all really, really good. All right, you guys, that is the end of this video and the end of this series. Let me know if you guys liked it, and if you have a favorite ice cream, let me know which one is your favorite. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video and this series. I had so much fun. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.